Yo, what's up, Agent? I'm back to you again. On my last video, I did a full guide about the new season 2.0. So, guys, if you are new here, you need to watch the first video so you can understand everything about the new season. Because this video is all about the journey mission. I'm going to explain it to you and give you tips and tricks on how to use it. Now, I'm going to start with the first one because now I'm uh, on, uh, as you see, journey mission 6. The first one is so easy, like um, nothing special. Eliminate hostiles with a primary weapon, 150. Primary weapon is your main gun, so that's easy. Also, the second one, complete the Grand Washington Hotel machine. Choose uh, any difficulty you want, and easy also. Loot pieces of gear, pieces of gear, not weapons, not mod, not anything. L loot pieces of gear, like. Uh, if you open your caches, it doesn't count. If your teammate share loot with you, that doesn't care. Doesn't uh, count, I'm sorry. Only you need to loot. And use the boss skill. You use the boss skill like uh, you don't need enemies nearby or you boss enemies. You just need to use the boss skill. Right? Even if you are alone, there is no one nearby. And buy an item from the theater settlement, uh, settlement vendor. Is this one. Buy any, buy any item you want. It's easy also. Complete propaganda. Three. Also, like, choose any difficulty. And uh, it's easy. Complete air and space museum machine. Choose any difficulty also. And liberate a control point. Four. Just take four control point. The, that's it. The, like I told you, joining mission one is so easy. And you need to pay attention. You don't need to complete. As you see now, we have three, six, eight. We have eight mission. I'm sorry, objective. All right. We just need to complete six and get rid of two. When you complete six, it's going to have you see, it's going to tell you complete it and claim your reward. Now we can move to joining mission two. Complete main mission, eight times. That's easy. How? You're gonna play Lincoln Memorial, okay? Eight times. Because this mission is small, and it's so easy to complete. Choose whatever difficulty you want. I played this mission with Hunter Fury and Lady Death, and the mission took me like five minutes or, or less. So it's, it's, it's too easy and fast. Because the time is so important with this, with this journey mission thing, because it's so annoying. Anyway, eliminate true sounds. You're gonna get rid of that because it's gonna take more long time from you. This one is easy. You just need to destroy your loot, like any any loot. When you well, like when you start to play the season, you can have a lot of loot, so it's not gonna be difficult to you to just destroy your items anything uh, weapon mod piece of gear anything and the craft gear pieces 15 you yeah, it's easy go to the safe house or any table like crafting station and uh, craft gear pieces only gear pieces not guns not mods not anything only gear pieces claim a battle pass reward uh, like when you when you play, it's going to be here your like your reward, as you see like this one. Now when you do this, like it's gonna that's it. And the complete public execution five easy, complete decent loops. Uh, by the way, <coughs> on this uh, journey mission, as you see, I skip this one, and I skip this one. Because the decent is so annoying, but uh, we play. I play this later. So on this journey machine, I skip the second one and the decent loop thing. <clears throat> this option, the last one, loot items of specialization or higher quality. Like uh, it's sixty. It's, it's a long. It's a like uh, it's too much. All right. Because you want a good loot. Okay? 
So if you want to play decent loop, I don't know. But uh, for me, I I I I I was already have a lot of uh, loot uh, from that specialized uh, loot. But for you, choose whatever you want. You have decent loop or loot items. Don't forget, you need only six of eight. And you're gonna, you're gonna be ready to claim your reward and move to the next one. Now we are on mission journey three. It tells you like complete territory controls ten. Easy. Open on the activity, choose difficulty, anything you want, and that's it. And complete the second union arena. Like also, choose normal or hard and and easy. Complete Roosevelt Islands. Uh, Roosevelt Island stronghold, also easy. Uh, <coughs> eliminate Virtin hostiles with a headshot. You know, Virtin hostiles, they are the purple enemies. Alright? So, purple enemies, you find them on hard difficulty or challenge. Okay? Uh, headshot, I play with the pistol, like a pistol determined. I was rushed and uh, it's easy, it was so easy because I run, not hide in the, like behind cover or whatever. That's going to be easy. And then uh, in uh, mission, and uh, like in Lincoln, most of the skills I got in uh, Lincoln. Complete bounties, five. This is so annoying. So I really hope you like uh, just uh, get rid of it. Uh, craft opens. Easy craft crafting station the five weapons. Equip item from the same brand. Ah, uh, okay. Look, you put uh, four pieces of the same brand. All right. As you see now, on this build I have three of Lingmo. All right. What I'm gonna use? I hope I have one piece here. Look, it's like this way. Four pieces from the same brand and uh, easy. Not the only uh, like Nigmo, like uh, choose any, anyone, any like any company you want. It's only you need to have brand set, not gear set. You need to pay attention for that. Do not resources to control points. It's like when you com when you com when you complete a control point, you're gonna donate for him for the officer with uh, more than uh, 200 so if you complete two control points you're gonna donate for like uh, two control points and that's it easy I, uh, like I told you in the beginning uh, skip the uh, skip the bounties the bounties is so annoying alright and choose whatever you want other option the, the rest of them it's easy but the bounties so annoying because it's, it's take a long time from you. Then, uh, like I told you, six of eight. Now we're ready. Claim your reward and jump to the next journey mission four. The first, uh, the first uh, objective is eliminate Vertian hostiles at close range. That's like I told you, uh, purple uh, enemies. With a pistol, determined, and rush, and uh, easy. Eliminate uh, elite hostiles at long range. I did this with the determined uh, sniper. It was so easy. Complete party objective. All right, this one is here. Party objective. Party objectives. Like uh, tell you, it uh, give you exotic, it give you resources, it give you XP, it give you also XP for the season if you not complete the season, and it gives you it give you modifier. All right, here, as you see, what it says, complete part your objective to unlock passive modifier. But before you do that, you need to make sure that. When you see the mission, it told you, like uh, below, as you see, next to you what, it told you that, like, it's gonna give you, uh, 
What the name of God? Mm. Modifier. And it's gonna tell you the, the name of the modifier. Like it's gonna give you drawback on patient. Or the thing is, you need to make sure that it told you that I'm gonna give you the modifier. I'm gonna reroll just to have to find one. No, I can't. As you see, there is a, a three bars uh, below. When you complete the mission, that's gonna fill the bar. As you see, below it says reload capacity. You have two rerolls, complete priority objective to earn more. So each time you complete a mission, it's gonna give you like the ability to reroll. But when you're done of reroll, like you don't want this objective, you're gonna change. Okay, look, I don't need this one. Do you see? There is I have no reroll. Do you see no reroll? Because like my, I, I I don't have more. I need to play mission now to gain uh, like a credit, so I can be able to reroll again. The point is, on a priority objective, when you play them, it's gonna give you like a reward, an XP, and it's gonna give you modifier, which is so important when you reach from 4 and above, all right? Now on 4, uh, priority objective, when you made it to this one, you need to choose open world activity. Do I have it now? Uh, yeah, look. Open world activity is gonna tell you like, uh, go play, uh, like, uh, oh, go beat uh, territory control or execution. It's so easy, it's so fast. Don't choose the stronghold. It's gonna take you take a long time from you. And if it says PVB, it's okay. Choose that option. It's gonna give you tell you like go to bring a, go to do something like uh, take a landmark in the dark zone or take a drop in the dark zone. The dark zone now is empty, so there is nothing there is nothing uh, difficult in this. Complete the capital building stronghold. And recalibrate items. Recalibrate items, it's so easy. Look, you just need to one piece. Hope I have one here. Anything, anything, any any piece you don't want. I just see this one. Look. Armor. Open damage. This is the same piece. You don't need to to, to keep change. You see? Five times, make a change on the same piece five times. And uh, that's it, you're ready. I see five times. Completed our base in stronghold, invaded. Pay attention. You play this, invaded. And any difficulty you want. Alright? Eliminate cleaners, get rid of this. Don't play it. And by the way, the, the objectives. Uh, with the purple, uh, I'm sorry, with orange, uh, orange uh, color is uh, like uh, as you see on the right, on the top, it's in New York. So the eliminate cleaners, get rid of it, and the last one, uh, like uh, take a control point in New York Five. I complete this one. If you want, you can take this one and this one. Get rid of this one if it's uh, gonna take a long time from you, and they play the rest and get rid of this one. So you can play six and get rid of two. After I complete this one, the journey machine is gonna activate the Isaac mod, which is reversal active modifier, and it's gonna give you also exotic five uh, exotic components. Here, you're gonna see now, I have it now. And uh, since I reached to level uh, mission, uh, journey mission six, I have uh, prime time also. I only have one left. But you need to play a uh, priority objective because it's gonna give you this one. All right, do you see? Each one I don't have is say complete party objective to unlock passive modifiers. 
like when you when you when you have nothing to do, you need to play uh, uh, priority objective, so you can unlock those because you're gonna need them in your, the next challenge. Now I'm on uh, now I'm on six, and uh, I'm gonna show you my my challenge, my mission lock. You need those with the fires. When you made it to like journey journey mission six, and you don't have them with the fire. You're gonna need them. It's like it's like you lost your time. So you play part your objective. You need to play the mission that told you I'm gonna give you the modifier. Keep that in your mind. That's it for today. My my journey mission from five and six and seven. I'm gonna complete them and I'm gonna boost another video because five and six and seven it's so difficult. It's so difficult. And in my next video I'm gonna explain it to you. Now, hope you enjoyed this one. I hope to see you next day. I hope to see you later. Skeletal Rock, peace out.